<laughs> Spend an hour with Clarence Smoyer. I was a tank gunner. And he's sure to tell you a few stories. I destroyed two tanks in, in uh, the invasion of Cologne. Stories about triumph. We were driving the Germans back out of Cologne. And also about loss. I saved them one time, but I couldn't do it the second time. <laughs> moment. We interrupt our program to bring you a special broadcast. That made history. Now for the German. Her lieutenant said, uh, gentlemen, I give you cologne. Let's knock the hell out of it. And we obliged them. History captured in these black and white films. And now here's a bulletin that's just been handed me. And in the pages of this book. For Clarence, there's a, a German tank down in the courtyard. His entire life. I fired and hit him right dead center. Has been defined by a few brave minutes. After the war, the crewmen from the light tank always tell me, you saved my life in Cologne. Stories he tells to remember. It never goes away. It's, it stays, stays with me all the time. So that no one will ever forget. I hope they realize the hard times we went through during the war. <laughs> Today, the stories in this book came to life in downtown Denver. So we'll take you over here and we're going to take you up the ladder. When Clarence oh, boarded oh, a tank. Oh. Take your time, one step at a time. For a very special ride to honor a Denver hero killed in World War II, General Maurice Rose. Greatest general in the war. He uh, always used to tell his men, we'll lead from the front. There we go. And although Clarence's body isn't what it used to be. Right, you used to be able to hop, hop up there like nothing. Although the parade only spanned a couple of blocks. A real American hero, yes! This ride told the story about the soldiers who sacrificed everything for the sake of history. They don't teach anything like, like that anymore. Megan Lopez, Denver 7.